Good morning and happy Tuesday, everybody. I am currently in Baltimore, Maryland for the day, so I figured while I'm out here, might as well check out some thrift stores. The sun is out, the sun is shining, it's a hot day, it's a beautiful day for some thrifting, and let's see what we got in store for today. The first stop is gonna be this Value Village thrift store. I've never been here, but I'm hoping they come through with some heat. Let's see what they got. First find this quick little essential polo shirt, size large. Got the horse here. I wish it wasn't five bucks, but not bad. It's NBA team shirt, brand new with the tags, size 3X. This thing is looking humongous. Yo, this shirt is great. $2.99 with that Rasta Peter Griffin. <laughs> On the jersey section, we got a RG3, AJ Hawk for 10 Joe Flacco for 20 that's crazy. Todd Heap for only 5 Ray Rice for 10 No one wants that. I don't know who this is. Mari Stoudemire for only 5 bucks, but... Come on, bro. No! God! And then this Youth Maple Leafs one's actually really nice. It's all stitched on for 12 bucks. Long sleeve, but it's got some stains. Decent find for $3.99, this Nike Vintage 2000 Super Bowl 35 Baltimore Ravens AMC Conference Championships sweatshirt. I'll probably grab that. New Balance coming with the heat. With that all over invisible print camo long sleeve. This is kind of dope. I might just keep this. It's my size. That old school looking Oregon Duck sweatshirt. <laughs> Another essential with this size large red polo jacket. Unfortunately, whoever owned this last got tippled too hard and there is a giant hole in the sleeve. So this one's no good. Old school Reebok windbreaker. Unfortunately, they are asking 11 bucks. On the fence on this one. It's got that NBA All-Star 2001 patch by Majestic for $5.99 size XL. Not sure. That leather jacket. Philadelphia Eagles NFL tag on the back. We got the Eagle too, but Bruh Starting off well in the shoe section. We got a pair of Nike Prestos These look honestly really clean Are those Yeezys? Oh my gosh These are terrible blazers, but they're asking 20 for them and What are these? I'm gonna have to do some research, but these are dope got some B LeBron 9s and I got really excited when I saw these 11s for a second but these are faker than a $3 bill look at that jump man that's terrible some Air Max 95s oh, so that one came through two bags of heat definitely a success ended up spending 55 bucks copped a bunch of pairs of shoes a couple sweatshirts and some other stuff um, but let's see what else Baltimore has to offer. I'm gonna hop into this next value village and see what they got. They're Griffey Maxes, but they're coming apart. And they're 15. And then these also look really clean, but coming apart. They're like Nike boots, moccasins, they're furry inside. Jordan shirt, but it's 10. And also brand new classic Nike, but it's also 10. Pulled out all the jerseys. really beat Air Force Ones and then a Steve McNair jersey they didn't really have anything and it was all kind of expensive or destroyed so it's all right on to the next one next stop Laurel Thrift do with tags Orioles sort of type of jersey thing it's embroidered 15 but it's 25% off and then a Ray Lewis jersey same thing but it's Bryce Harper to the Antonio Brown clip. To the races! And Le'Veon Bell too. And Diamond Turfs for 10 bucks. Jordan Son of Mars. 20. 2.98. Sean Taylor. Manning Youth XL for five. 
Ben Roethlisberger Youth XL for five. See that Santa Hill up in the mannequin? You know how much I want for it? Forty dollars. Bruh. Insane. For that one, only thing I got was that T-shirt. It was three bucks. Except as I was ringing up to pay, um, I put in my phone number, and the woman told me I had twenty bucks on store credit because it's the same chain where I dropped one hundred and sixty last week on all those jerseys. So can't beat free. Last stop of today is gonna be Plato's Closet. Never seen these before. Pennies, LeBron's, Bronze, Little Kids, Jordan 12s, LeBron 10 Floridians, Jordan 10s. Another pair of tens and some twos. And that Play-Dohs was a bust. So I'm gonna head home now and I'll break everything down when I get back. Oh hey, didn't see you there. Come on, let's see what I bought today. So yeah man, I grabbed two full bags and um, I guess I'll start with the shoes and let's break everything down. First pair I picked up is this pair of Nike Prestos. Um, these are in pretty good condition and I scooped them for only around eight or nine bucks and they're a size nine. Next, I picked up these Griffey Maxes. Um, these are in my size, so they're probably just gonna stay in my personal collection because these are dope. Um, these are the South Beach colorway, and these were $11.99, and they're also 20% off, so more like nine or 10 bucks. Picked up these Air Max 95s. I wish they were a little bit bigger. They're a size six and a half men's, or like an eight, eight and a half women's, but they were only $16, so still a great buy on these. And then lastly, I couldn't leave them behind. I scooped the Yeezys. Um, I haven't officially authenticated these yet, but I mean, I think it's pretty safe to assume that they're fake as hell. But overall, I mean, they're not terrible. Like, they're in decent condition, and they are more my size, so if I ever, you know, feel like I need to rock some fake Yeezys, I have these. So let's move on to the clothing that I picked up today. So I picked up this Stussy t-shirt. Um, I just thought it was a dope graphic. It sort of looks like that Chanel double C or Gucci logo, um, and it was super cheap, so I had to grab it. Picked up this vintage Nike uh, Ravens Super Bowl or Conference Championship sweatshirt. Then I grabbed this really dope camo um, like crew neck sweatshirt. It's New Balance. It's got the logo embroidered right here. Um, this one might stay in my personal collection. Haven't decided yet. And then lastly, I grabbed the Rasta Peter Griffin T-shirt. Just thought it was super funny. And $2.99 plus 20% off. Didn't want to leave it. So yeah, man, that's everything I picked up today. Thanks so much for checking out my video. Um, if you're interested in any of the items that you saw today or any of the items behind me, make sure to check out my eBay website in the link in the description. Um, I've got a lot of stuff for sale and I'd be happy to give you guys a discount on anything. Just shoot me an offer. Um, otherwise, make sure to hit the subscribe button because I've got lots more content coming your way and I'll see you all on the next one.